What's going on, YouTube? Mike, aka Madness DFS with the Sharp Bab DFS Army, formerly on Twitter, still locked out and in our Discords. Uh, back with another MLB Prize Picks video Saturday, June twenty second. It's a rainy, rainy Saturday up here in Wisconsin. Been a rainy week, honestly. Uh, hit that like and subscribe on your way in. Uh, helps us grow this channel and get you as much free content as you can. And you see the promo code on your screen, Mad M A D D. When you use that on Prize Picks and Sleeper, you're gonna and or Sleeper, you can use it on either one. They're gonna match your first deposit up to a hundred dollars on Prize Picks and five hundred dollars. Might be two hundred fifty dollars on Sleeper. Uh, now that I think about it, but either way, they're gonna match your deposit and shoot me a message and I'll hook you up with two free months of Sharp App Pro, which gets you access to our Discord and our premium tools, which I'll be running through very shortly. I have my or the Discord pulled up on my screen. We hit this last night, Colin Ray, under three and a half strikeouts. I don't think he had a singular strikeout. Was expecting some major regression coming from him, and we got it. Willie Castro just dominated the over one and a half hits runs RBI. He did get a homer in that game, but he had it beat before the homer anyway. So that put us over on the day. I think video picks yesterday struggled a little bit, went one and two. Um, Knack and Eric Fede had some, had some rough games, so we'll chalk that one up. But overall, we did make some money uh, due to the protected picks and all that kind of stuff. So jump in our Discord. We are dropping these slips all day, every day. Mitch has a free bet in there already. Mutt's got some WNBA props up. So check those out. They are free. I'll leave a link in the description to come take advantage if you don't want to join as a pre member, premium member. If you do, if you join as a free member, make a little bit of money, pay for your subscription, come join us. That simple. So, uh, let's get into it. First play on the board. We're going to the Proptimizer. This is our Proptimizer. It's the best price picks tool in the industry, bar none. There's a mobile version for it as well. We have the same uh, tool for Sleeper too. So if you're over on Sleeper, we've got we've got you hooked up there. So, mobile version on the golf course, at the bar, at the game, load it up, win some money. Easy as that. First play we're going to go to is Zach Wheeler under seven strikeouts. Let's get him pulled up here. Zach, where you at? Come on now. Under. We don't want more. Uh, what do we got? 55.6% odds to hit. He's gone under this number in six of his last seven games. Even money, even some small juice to the over or uh, under six and a half. At, what am I doing? Sorry, messing with my microphone. Um, dog saying hi too. Holy moly. It's a zoo around here. Even money and some small juice to the under six and a half at some book. So good value here at seven. 28 or 26.8% K rate on the season, which is solid, uh, but nothing crazy considering the Diamondbacks aren't a great strikeout matchup. 20.7% strikeout rate as a whole for them. I like taking the under seven for Zach Wheeler to get us started. I have four picks for you today. I dropped one in the Discord already, but I'm going to give it to you for free as well because I like it. It's a bonus pick. I wouldn't go too heavy on it considering it's a demon play, but. We'll get there. It'll be the last one. So hang around, hang around to the end, and we'll get to that one. Next up, we're going to go to Corey Seager. And I want to take his over one and a half hits, runs, and RBI. This comes from the Proptimizer as well. We'll call it a 54% odds to hit here. Heavy juice to the over at the books. We don't pay that juice on prize picks. Love the matchup against Michael Waka at home. Seager has Waka's number in his career. A career 7 for 15, which, which gets him to a 467 batting average, 500 on base percentage, and 600 slug. Love Corey Seager, over one and a half hits, runs RBI. Then we're going to go to Corbin Burns, over six strikeouts. Also from the Proptimizer, you can see how much I'm in this thing. Where are you at, Corbin? Still got his Brewer's hat on in our Proptimizer. 50, we'll call it a 54, 53.5% odds to hit here. Even money at the books at six and a half. So we're getting good value at six, at least six strikeouts and four of his last six games. The thing with him, 24.2% strikeout rate on the season, but has some pretty substantial positive regression coming his way. Uh, looking at his chase rates and his whiff numbers, that number is going to come shooting up. He's generally a 30 plus percent strikeout rate guy in his career. So love attacking this number while it's still low. I think we're going to see this get up to the eight range as the season goes on. Love Corbin Burns here. There are three free plays, and I do have a bonus one for you. I dropped it in the Discord. We're going to go to Luis Robert home run. You can bet this at the books, too, if you don't want to throw it in your prize pick slip. This one I'm going to play as kind of a separate play. I'm not going to include it in the full slip because I want to put a 
0.2 unit on these three plays. This one, bonus one, sprinkle it here and there. But love the spot here for Luis Robert. He's been pretty slow to start the season, but starting to see the ball a little bit better. Also has a great matchup against Kenta Maeda. Uh, Maeda, 6.02 ERA in the season, X ERA over five. So it just hasn't been pretty for Maeda. He's got his number two. Three home runs against Maeda in his career. Love taking Luis Robert home run here. Like I said, it's a demon play, so sprinkle it here and there. Don't go too crazy on it, but love Luis Robert to round us out. There are some free plays for you. I will be dropping plays in the Discord all day long, so go check those out and hit that like and subscribe on your way out. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys on the next one. Let's win some money, eh? Happy Saturday.